shut the hell up. Dead serious. It was Tommy's birthday, and that's all he wanted to do is just rent two Harleys and drive cross country. Oh, man. I could die happy if I could just ride one around the block. <laughs> what was it like? It was good. It was real good. Good? Can, can you believe this guy? Come on, man, give me details. Describe it. <laughs> you know what? You two deserve a little privacy. No, no, Ellie, Ellie. This isn't just any regular motorcycle, okay? You get on that bad boy, you feel that engine? Nothing like it. Oh, yeah, how would you know? Seen it in my dreams. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't think anyone from my group is gonna show up. Yeah. Worst part about it all, explaining it to Sam. Well, it's safe to say those two have officially bonded. What are you doing? Taking stock of all the food we found today. I see. And how are we doing on canned peaches? Did Henry send you? No. Why would Henry send me? To make sure I'm not fucking up somehow. I'd say we all did pretty good back there. Especially you. Is everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. Okay. Well, have a good night. How is it that you're never scared? Who says that I'm not? What are you scared of? Uh, let's see. Scorpions are pretty creepy. Uh, being by myself. I'm scared of ending up alone. What about you? Those things out there. What if the people are still inside? What if they're trapped in there without any control of their body? Scared of that happening to me. Okay. First of all, we're a team now. Okay, we're gonna help each other out. And second, they might still look like people, but that person is not in there anymore. Henry says that they've moved on, that they're with their families, like in heaven. Do you think that's true? I go back and forth. I mean, I'd like to believe it. But you don't. I guess not. Yeah, me neither. Oh, all the serious talk, I almost forgot. There, if he doesn't know about it, can't take it away. All right, I'm pooped. I'll see you tomorrow. That smells good. Good morning. Where's Sam? I let him sleep in for once. Oh. Well, if you want him to join us, you can go wake his ass up. Okay. Sam? 
What the hell? Shit, he's turning! That's my fucking brother! Screw it! Shit! Really? Gotta go, you're right. Oh my god. Sam? Oh no. Sam? Henry? Ellie, stay there. Henry? What have you done? I'm gonna get that gun from you, okay? Oh, okay, okay, easy. This is your fault. This is nobody's fault, Henry. It's all your fault! Henry! Henry, no! Jackson County. Means we're close to Jackson City, right? Should be more than a few miles. You ready to see dear old brother? I'm just ready to get there. You nervous? I don't know what I'm feeling. So much for this road. You just follow the river. It'll lead us straight to Tommy's. Come on. Between you two. What do you mean? You and Tommy. You're not together, so clearly something went down. We just had a bit of a disagreement, that's all. Ah, oh, here we go. <clears throat> so what was it about? Tommy saw the world one way, I saw it the other. And that's why he joined the Fireflies. <laughs> yeah, your friend Marlene promised him hope. That kept him busy for a while, but just like Tommy, he eventually quit that too. How was it? The last time you saw him. <laughs> I believe his last words to me were, I don't ever want to see your goddamn face again. Jeez. But he's gonna help us? I suppose we're gonna find out. Well, is there without his help? We'll get there. Let's just keep going.
What's that? That right there is a hydroelectric power plant. <laughs> I... a hydro who? It, uh, it uses the river's movement and uh, turns it into electricity. How's it do that? Look, I know what it is. I don't know how it does it. All right. How are we getting across? We'll make it across. I'll find something. I need you to... I know. Step on the fucking pallet. Oh, give it a spin. Too small, grave. Look, 
forgot to leave that stupid robot on his grave. What should I do with it? Um, what? I want to talk about it. No. Why not? How many times do we need to go over this? Things happen, and we move on. It's just... That's enough. <sighs> All right. I'm sorry. I know, I am too. All right, next squirrel I see, I'm totally shooting it. Let's get past this place, then we can scrounge up some food. Well, if I starve, you're responsible. Head in? Uh, ain't no way around. Gonna have to cut through the plant. Don't even think about reaching for your weapon. Tell the girl to drop hers now. Ellie, do as the lady says. Hey, please tell me you're lost. Oh, we didn't know the place was occupied. We're just trying to make our way through. Through to where? They're all right. But you know these people? I know him. He's my goddamn brother. Tommy. Holy shit. What are you doing, baby brother? God damn. Yeah. Let me look at you. You get fucking old. Easy. It's going to happen to you, too. This is Maria. Be nice to her. She sort of runs things around here. Ma'am, thanks for not blowing my head off. Would have been embarrassing, considering you're my brother-in-law. We all gotta get wrangled up at some point. Well, Ellie, right? Yeah. What brings you through here? Uh... That's kind of a long story. Why don't we bring him inside? Yeah. You hungry? Starving. False alarm! They're friendlies. We've been dealing with raids. A lot of bandits in this area. It's been quiet for a few days. What the hell are you doing here? I thought I'd find you in Jackson. Been trying to bring the plant back to life. We had it working before, but one of the turbines went south. We have electricity, Joe. I had. We'll get her running again. No way. You guys have horses. We got a whole lot of them. Hey, Tommy, give me a hand with this. Sorry, I'll be right back. Can I? Yeah, of course. He likes when you pet his ears. You ever ride one? I actually have. When have you ridden a horse? 
Uh, Winston, this soldier back in the zone, he gave me lessons. You know, if you want, we can take him riding later. That'd be awesome. There. Hey, thanks, Tommy. No sweat. All right, let's continue the tour. Earl? Yeah? Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to head back this morning? Still waiting on Hauser and the rest of the boys to relieve me. Oh, no. You know, we'll be fine. Just go home to your family. It's just a couple more hours. I'll tough it out. All right, look, take it easy. Maria. Yeah, go ahead. We're in the control room. Steve's about to start it back up. You want to come check it out? I'd rather eat with Ellie. It's my turn anyway. I'll go. I'll come with you. Go with Maria. Put some food in you. Joel. Come on, Ellie. Let's give the boys some space. I'm sending Tommy over. Stand by. This will be the sixth time of them trying to get the turbines back online. We've been here just a week, and it feels like forever. Uh, I got something for you. Last year, I went back to Texas, back home. Most of our stuff is long gone. Most of it. Here. It's a little faded, but it still looks pretty good. I'm good. You sure? I mean... I said I'm good. Okay. I'll hold on to it for you. Tommy, I... I need to talk to you. Privately. Yeah, okay. Let me just check on my guys real quick. Come on. I don't know what you heard, but you should see the town. We're over 20 families strong now. It was Maria and her father. They set up this place with the idea of being self-sustained. We got crops and livestock. Remember how we thought no one could live like this anymore? We're doing it. You're new around here. Yeah, Joel and Tommy's. Brother. War travels quickly around these parts. Apparently. I kind of see the resemblance. What do you do for protection? The adults take turns guarding the perimeter. We can get an electrified fence when the plants are. But you still got to deal with infected, though, right? We do. This is the world we live in. Or maybe you don't have to be.
Hey, buddy. That's Buckley. Not much of a guard dog. Maybe good to have around. <laughs> That's a good boy. These two geniuses are gonna bring this plant back to life. We think we got it this time. <laughs> you don't believe us? I didn't say that. I'll bet you a million bucks it works. Sure, make it two. Uh, we're almost ready. They just need to finish putting the shield back on. No rush. Let's see what we got.
That'll do. To the left. Watch it. Okay, that's good. Lower it. Slowly. All right. That's good. Tommy's here. You good to go? Give me one second. Okay, good to go. Ready? Go ahead. Hit it. Here we go. God damn! We did it, boys! Nice work, boys. Somebody get on the horn and give Maria the good news. You see that? That's pretty impressive. Looks like you're out two million bucks. <laughs> All right, Joel. Let's go talk. Quite the crew you got here. Yeah, they're good men. This place gives them a second chance. Gives us all a second chance. So why'd you leave Boston? I've been on quite the adventure, little brother. I reckon it's got something to do with that girl. <laughs> it's got everything to do with that little girl. Well, go on then. She's immune. Immune to what? Oh, come her, on. I know I've seen her breathe enough spores to take down a dozen men. And nothing. Now, I wouldn't have believed it neither. But I can show you. All right. I'll bite. Why bring her here? I was supposed to deliver to the Fireflies. The way I figure they're your boys. <laughs> You finish the job, you collect the whole damn payment. I haven't seen a firefly in years. But you know where they are. Now, I'm not asking for much, Tommy. I just want some simple gear, enough to set me on my way. What makes you think I'd do this for you? This isn't for me, Tommy. This is for your damn cause. My cause is my family now. You ain't talking about some walk in the park here. Jesus, boy. Have Maria get some of your born-again friends to do it. They but got I... families, too. Tommy, I need this. You want some gear? Sure. But I ain't taking that girl off your hands. This is how you gonna repay me, huh? Repay you? For all those goddamn years I took care of us. Took care? That's what you call it? I got nothing but nightmares from those years. You survived because of me! It wasn't worth it. I bring you the cure from mankind, and you wanna play the pissy little brother? We ain't back in Boston. You lay your hands on me again, it won't end well for you. The hell is that? We're under attack. You still remember how to kill, right? Yeah. Shit! Bandit! <laughs> Stop him! Don't let him into the building!
I see anything. We got him. Let's get to the bridge. Tommy, bandits, they're breaking into the building. Can you get out of there? No, we're trapped. We're gonna come to you, just stay. They're here, Ellie, hide. Maria, God damn it. Those sons of bitches. We gotta get to the girls. Right behind you. Right there. Joe, do your thing.
Do your thing. Get him! On the stairs! Too damn close. You okay? Yeah, 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 I'm fine. Joel! Oh man, they were coming in from every direction, then Maria was like, we gotta run, and so we dove over these tables, and this huge guy blasted with a shotgun. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Listen, then... hey, hey, are you hurt? No. God damn it. I need to talk to you. Absolutely not. You tell him to go find somebody else. Maria, I can't have this hanging over my head. Do you have any idea how many men we lost here today? Hey, what's that all about? Does that have anything to do with me? We'll talk about it later. Did he tell you where the lab is? We'll talk about it later. Later. Right. One fuck up, and then I turn into one of those widows, okay? I have to do this. I don't know what else to say. Fine. Maria. Maria! Here we go. You. If anything, anything at all happens to him, it's on you. She's thankful, you know. Yeah, I know. I'll take that girl of yours to the Fireflies. You don't have to worry about it. It's best this way. Well, maybe some real good will come of this. I need to talk to Ellie. Say again, I didn't hear you. Joe! Wait, what is it? That girl of yours, she took one of our horses and rode off. Damn it. Which way? Come on. I just saw her riding on out of here. Go back inside. Help the others clean the place up. Okay. Be careful out there. There. See the tracks? Yeah. Come on. 